Hey guys, what's up? It's Joe from Joe's Talking. Welcome back to my channel. And this is the Insta360 GO 3. Is it focusing on me? Maybe if I put it over here. Anyway, this thing is kind of amazing. Uh, it's got that flip up screen. Um, this thing pops out right here, right? If I grab it right, yep. Snaps back in. I'm sure you've seen tons and tons and tons of footage on this camera, but when I was looking around and I was trying to decide whether or not to buy this camera, I was just looking for someone that had gone and used it as a vlog. So that's what I'm gonna do today. I'm gonna run around with the Insta360 GO 3 and I'm gonna test it out as a vlogging setup. And keep in mind, I'm not gonna color correct. I'm gonna use the audio from the Insta360 GO 3. I'm not gonna make it all pretty like the Insta360 GO 3 commercials. I'm just gonna use it as is. So come along with me and let's take this thing for a spin. Let's get the day started. Let's go. Okay, first stop. I need gas. Get some of that high-priced California gas. That five to six dollar California gas. Ah, it sucks. the door jam. I'm gonna put it back in the holder. There we go. Got the mount mounted to the to the Bronco. A little hand sanitizer to make sure I don't get COVID. Again. Thank you. Hi, good morning. Can I get a iced decaf Americano? Like it's not in the way. Like if I had a giant camera right now, you'd be like, get that thing out of my face. Yeah, 100% of that. No, I think I might've gone a little too short. What do you guys think? Yeah, that is short. That is short. It'll grow back. So living here in Los Angeles, as you can imagine, there's a lot of entertainment people here. And having lived here for 20 years now, a lot of these people are my friends. So I have a lot of friends who are writers and actors, and they are all striking. Everyone is on strike. Look at the entrance to Warner Brothers. Everybody is striking. Hey there, I'm just picking up my food to go. Yeah. Thanks. I can just grab this while it's recording in the dock. Let's see, I think I can at least. Yeah, and I'll just grab it and I will put it on my shirt. Yes. Yes. That was yours? That's it. Okay. Perfect. Thank you. So do you know what I find absolutely amazing about the Insta360 GO3? It's the number of places you can put this thing. Oh boy. Now I can't reach it. For example, I'm gonna put it here. Look at that. You see that little spot right there? Let's stick it in there. Boom. 
Look at that. Can you put a DSLR in there? Or what about putting it here? You see that? It's on the disc brakes of my truck. Tell me that's not weird. It is so small that no one knows that I'm carrying a camera. I get super self-conscious when I'm carrying a camera in public and half the time I pull my camera out and then I put it away because I'm too scared. <laughs> Hey guys, so what did you think? Honestly, what'd you think? Well, I'll tell you, here's my verdict. I think this thing is pretty incredible. The one downfall is the fact that it is only 2.7K, it's not 4K. So at times, if there's not enough light, it may be a little grainy. But let's talk about the microphone. The microphone is so, so, so good. I mean, this little thing, this little thing right here has two mics. So the audio was pretty good. I mean, wouldn't you agree? Let me know in the comments below if you don't. And here's one thing that I was surprised that I actually liked. I like the fact that it doesn't have an SD card because it means I'm not carrying around multiple SD cards. This thing is 128 gigs and it was plenty. I also like the fact that this thing doesn't have extra batteries. I don't have to carry extra batteries because it can't take them. Because when I go out, a lot of times, I feel it's such a hassle to pack everything. But the absolute best, the absolute best part of this is the mounting system. You can put it on your chest, you can put it on your hat, you can put it on any sort of metal object, you can put it on your windshield, and the thing is, this thing just clips in and out so easily. Look at that, I mean, so quick, you know? It's not like a GoPro where you have to put all these different mounts on. Their mounting system is incredible. Anyway guys, I hope that helps you make a decision on whether or not you wanna buy this camera. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you in the next video.